So we got our hammocks uh, ready and we got the tarp and we are testing out some new equipment um, which I will talk a little bit more uh, about. Uh, when I say we it's because um, I am accompanied by my son who is there with me um, and we started of course that it was my fault I was too lazy and we started <laughs> As always, a little bit too late, and now it's almost midnight. But still, I think there is some light. Uh, hopefully you can see me. Uh, I will go behind the camera and just show you the, the setup um, of our camp. Uh, I'm, I must be careful because behind me there's a... Uh, uh, I, I'm on a, on a, standing on a rock, basically which you can see, I guess. Um, now, that's our tarp. Now, I was sent uh, from Warbonnet Hammock. I was sent um, uh, both the tarp and uh, Blackbird XLC. So, I'm very happy about that. Um, so this will be my first night in that hammock. Um, let's walk a little bit closer. <clears throat> Down this quite, it's a quite steep hill. I'll, I'll explain why we set up camp here. Uh, well, oops. Hi there, hopefully you can still see me. Well, uh, in this direction there is a, uh, a river and we walked down there, but it was just too noisy. It's been raining quite a lot. So we decided to walk up here, up on this uh, hilltop. Um, and uh, yeah, we, uh, we had actually dinner at home before we left, so we it's uh, it is uh, past bedtime for me at least. I'm quite happy with uh, the setup. Uh, I struggled a lot with this suspension. Um, I think I did something wrong, but I I reverted to the good old marine knots that I've been using my whole life. Um, but that's maybe that's wrong. I don't know. We'll see. Um, but okay, yeah, so that that's all, uh, that, I think that's all, um, I'm quite, uh, I'm a bit tired actually, and uh, yeah, th so this is going to, this is just a few hours, uh, we're spending the night out in the woods, and it's, uh, you know, father and son time, it's, uh, it's that's important uh, to take time for that, so um, yeah. I'll be sleeping under here in my new in my new hammock. And this is where I will be spending the night to the right there in the green hammock there. So this is how it looks like inside our little home for the night. Um, there is something special about you know, making your own home out of simple means. Of course, everything around me is, I guess you could say, high tech, but <laughs> and modern materials. But still, you know, we have a simple shelter above us, and we have two hammocks, and um, there's something very special about that. You know. We are only spending a few hours out here in the woods. Uh, we're going back tomorrow morning after breakfast. Um, but still. Yeah, let me turn the camera 
around because you know um, I can't say that we will have a, this is a million star hotel because we have the tarp above us so but um, but still you know the, the view is always better when you're spending the night out in the woods compared to uh, when you're in a hotel for for instance so this is my well, not exactly my view I will be looking up <laughs> in, the, in the tarp but uh, we're out in the woods yeah okay oh it's midnight now I'm tired So it seems like we have uh, the birds are having a party in the tree right above us. At least there is one right above us. He, he or she doesn't mind that we talk or anything like that. It's, he or she just keeps going. It's very early, uh, but uh, I must say I, I slept well in, in the new hammock, very happy about that. Um, it is chilly, actually it's uh, July, but it's, uh, it's, it, it is chilly. It's going to get warm in just a couple of hours, I guess. but. Uh, yeah, we're just having, uh, we're just going to have a, a breakfast, a simple breakfast, uh, no, no campfire, everything is too dry for that. I think one of the best things about hammock camping is that you always have, a, you always have a chair, you know. <laughs> um, yeah, my breakfast, not much. I usually don't like uh, having a heavy breakfast, so yeah. Mm. French herbs and cheese. So I'm quite happy with this uh, hammock setup, um, the Blackbird XLC, if I remember correctly, from uh, Warbonnet hammocks. Um, they are they make all this stuff in uh, in uh, in the USA, 
so it's not China made, which uh, I think is important. Um, it's um, it's a very comfortable, by far the most comfortable hammock I've uh, I've slept in. So once you find that diagonal over here, you lie almost flat, and uh, I slept um, I slept very well. Now it has it comes with a bug netting. Um, let's see. <laughs> And you can <clears throat> spread this out. Uh, I didn't last night because it got late, and um, that's my excuse. <laughs> and it, it has um, a ridge line integrated <clears throat> and under quilt uh, that just just simply attached at the two ends here and an um, over quilt um, it has a double layer so that you can you can uh, actually use a sleeping pad here as well during winter and so um, what else yes it has a uh, shelf I don't know if you can see this, but on the other side here, a little uh, shelf or a pocket, a big pocket you can put stuff here. So this is a Chinese finger trap. And I struggled, I didn't get my finger caught here, but uh, I struggled figuring out how this was working. Um, and I think I should have used a carabiner hook up, up here. Um, I don't know. Uh, I'll, I'll have to ask them. Uh, I didn't know if, if it was strong enough, the, the, the ones that came with the... that was left over after I set everything up, so... Good old knot. Marine knot. Yeah. And it comes with uh, these, I think you call them tree huggers. Yeah. <laughs> Wonderful tarp, camouflage. So my son slept in. Um, this is uh, a ticket to the moon hammock. Very simple hammock uh, with a uh, bug netting. But uh, he used um, the Outdoor Vitals uh, Stormloft on the quilt and over quilt. Um, excellent quality, I must say. Excellent quality. And um, very warm. This is for winter. So they've actually rated this to zero degrees Fahrenheit. Um, that is very cold, so <clears throat> I don't know, um, but it is, it's excellent quality. Um, lightweight, uh, so you have to be careful with, with it, of course. Okay, so we are soon at uh, the car. The car is 
just up the road here. Um, and uh, well, thank you for spending this time with us up here by the by the Silver Stream. That's actually the name of that stream. We're uh, um, we didn't camp by the stream, obviously, but um, um, it was too noisy down there. But anyway, um, like if you liked the video, yeah, hit that like button and uh, subs consider subscribing if you are not already a subscriber. Um, yeah, I think that's all. Um, we'll talk soon. Bye.